Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Zero, and welcome back to Amori. Previously on Amori, we went and did a series of side quests as we head towards the eventual climax of the game. Hello, fellow bunner here. Look at your eyes, you see you've killed 50 buns. Splendid. I see you've destroyed more bunnies. That's 50 bunnies obliterated. Thank you so much, fellow bunny hater. Thanks. Now go and destroy more bunnies. Spin this wheel. Sure. Six or twenty clams? That's someone's lucky number. It's gonna be a price for your toll. Can I pay up? Yeah, sure. No. Oh, that's a shame. If you don't spin, you can't win. Well, where are you going, buddy? Make them nice and slow. There's a toll road here, you see? Clams will get lost. Let me go. You said it was a hard 20, 6 or 20 clams. I got the money for the clams. Let me just pay. Fine. I, I see how this game is going to go. Now hold on one second here. Numbers aren't adding up. You're going to have to spin again. Excellent spin, buddy. Yes. I feel like this is a scam. Hooey, we have a winner. 2500 My final offer. Nope. <laughs> Run away, ain't gonna change the price, kid. Let's go around. Think I'm gonna pay your price? I already know I can go around your toll. I was expecting to see some sea life. But don't see anything. I wasn't expecting this. I might look for the telescope and seek a fubu. Have I looked for this yet? I don't know. I might have. But I don't think I took a good look. Okay, what's over here? There's a watermelon here. Lemonade. Little sea plants. Catching fish and fish is a hobby of mine. It passes time is moderately a warning. Okay. Fish, fish sauce, fish oil, fish glue, fish gumbo, fish on the cob. I'm all out of tuna. Hey. Hey, look, I'm on the other side. I like how you shifted the wheel to the other way. I mean, no matter what, no matter what, you're gonna pay that toll. So you have to pay this one no matter what, okay. So I'm gonna open the gate, huh? Be my pleasure. Only well, cost of 2,000 clams. Sure. That one NPC said we should pay the second toll. You can sure are smart. Two dozen clams is a steal. Heh. <laughs> like stealing candy from a baby. Can I not get through like I'm scanned? No. It was fine. It's always longer than I thought it would be. Now it's gonna be a walk back to the start, too. Might as well keep going. I keep filling in the holes, but they just keep coming back. But I must have left my smoke sticks at home again. Burgers. Also, I see Space Boyfriend there. Space Ex Husband, mind you. Oh god. Yeah, no, yeah, I was right. To all those lost lovers out there, this one is for you. Mm. 
We all live in a yellow sub marine. I had to space that out for copyright reasons. <laughs> Hi, I'm Sadie. My sisters and I started this cafe together. This is Clamps and Tidal. All my sisters have said this to work at the last resort. It's just me and my sister Eleanor left. Huh. <sighs> Wish we'd come back here. I'd do anything to hear them sing again. Uh huh. Three orders. Uh huh. Uh huh. No, no. I can ask. Okay, so you want four orders now. Welcome to the mustard sub. May I take your order? Cheeseburger. Buy a couple burgs. But you could be singing forever. Guess so. Wait, I forgot something. Nothing. Water is a bit warmer than it is in the cave in the mountains. Caw. Bandit side. Caw. Toll road bark. I don't need a charity. Good for you. Be kind to others. Respect your community. Love yourself. These aren't sea cows. These are... Wizard squids? No, squizzards. Makes sense. Uh, moo? Hey, what's going on out there? What the hell? Oh, yes, yeah, a bucket of fresh and chunky sea cow milk. Would you like to drink some? Hey there, partner. Around these parts, I'm known as a sea cow farmer, but you can just call me Jim. This farm's been a family business, been going on for generations. The upkeep game's so easy with the land being overrun by squizzards and all. I tell you what, with all those dang squizzards running around, it's a miracle that this farm is still standing. If only there was someone who could help me get rid of these darn squizzards, I'd pay anything. Hi. Hey, you know what? I just had a brilliant idea. If y'all don't mind getting rid of some slimy, sneaky squizzards, I happily employ your services for some clams. I don't want it much, but it's all I got. Can't have no peace with all these darn squizzards running around. That eh, shouldn't be too bad. That's not a squizzard, that's a muscle. Wow, you got a skill that just knocks you out. I don't think I ever want to use this, but at the same time, it sounds kind of funny. This is an interesting skill. It looks like all attacks on a foe will hit right in the heart next turn. It's a little interesting. I think, as I determine, his heart's like a crit. Hmm. It's, it's interesting. I honestly always want to use it. It might be used for like a boss, but for generic enemies, I don't really want to run that around everywhere. Yeah, rid of them all. Hey, you all. You know, it's lately there are less squeezers causing trouble around these parts. You guys are really doing your fair share of work. Get some clams for your efforts. Go on and get something nice for yourself. <laughs> nice. Cover my tools. Now it's like a... I guess it's a repeatable quest for clams. Clems. We're in, we're in the clems now. Let's see what happens. I go through here. Okay. So that's where the Ever Cave takes you. So you can theoretically circumvent that one. Oh no, buns! 
What happens if I circumvent this one? Or rather, just pay the toll. Oh, where am I? Oh crap! Boss, like a wasn't sleep, I was just... Oh, you're just a bunch of kids. You just want me to open the gate. I'm gonna be real with you, these toll prices are jacked. It's gonna cost a 3,000 clams, but I thought I'd never wait around if I were you. Save money for a cool bike or something. Yeah, it's getting a little pricey for me. Item! Cheeseburger. Oof. Hey, what's up? Need to borrow this sushi. We are back. I'm gonna check south first. Oh, that's kind of scary. Welcome to Black Space. Yeah, I needed the S for space. Just need the, the W and the uh, T. No! These are one of my spikes at all costs, thank you. Hey, Mori. Looks like we reached the end of the road. Literally. Looks there's a long bridge up ahead. But if you do, don't look down. I can't believe we really made it all the way to the end of the highway. But you did. And you should all be proud. The bridge at the top of this cliff leads to a place called Deeper Well. Word is that Deeper Well has been around for a long time, but the bridge wasn't there until recently. Who knows what's on the other side? Do you think that's where Basil is? I don't know, it seems you guys don't care about him. We don't know him for sure. There's only one way to find out. That's kind of scary too. Is that any better? A clear bridge stretches across the trench. Do you want to cross it? The abyss. Where weird glowy plant things exist. And perhaps a giant like monster that would eat your submarine. Usually followed by some kind of cliche let's play reaction like, ah! Wow, just look at this place. There's so many cool plants around. I bet Basil would have really liked it here. Basil. He would have really liked it. Right, guys? Yeah. I'm sure he would have. Huh? What is it? Hey. I have a serious question. Do any of you remember what Basil looks like? Why do you ask that, hero? Let's see here. Basil... Basil loves taking care of flowers and taking photos of his friends. He's warm, calm, and gentle. Not really. And even when he's upset, he'll always manage a smile. The rest, 
It's starting to get a little fuzzy. It's okay. Me too, hero. It's like I still miss him, but... It's kind of hard to remember why. But that doesn't change anything, right? Even if our memories aren't as strong as they used to be? We still have to save him. Basil is our friend. And more importantly, he needs our help. You're right, Aubrey. I think we've all been apart from Basil for way too long. But I'm sure we'll find him. As long as we have a Mori to keep us on track. All this time Basil's been waiting for us. He could be lost. Lonely. Or scared. I bet he could use a big hug right now. Then we're all together again. We should all give him a big ol' hug. Ah. It's nice to see you two getting along so well for a change. I can hug the both of you right now. I'll be gross. Huh? Me and Kel? Get along? You don't get along in the future. What are you talking about, hero? Stop being weird. Huh. Well, actually, two, I'm just playing around. Hold on, Basil. We're almost there. We'll be all together soon. Let's go. Sea pizza. Hey, what's going on here? Your memory is not free. They gain a memory and never must be shrouded. And yet, all memories will eventually fade. But as you've already noticed, the curse of Deeper Well. Oh great, here we go. Thanks. What if it's up to you? What if it's only up to you? Carry on, Dreamer. You are the only one who can. The universe is full of questions that you will never answer. Yet, there are also ones that only you can answer. And the truth is revealed, what will you do? For a second there, I was trying to be if the seaweed was going to talk to me too. It is selfish to dream for so long when there are those who are expecting you. Don't you all commentate on my life. Time will always move forward. Eventually the truth will become clear. You know this well. Don't you, dreamer? Oh, sweet. When trouble shows itself, there's always a choice to run. But one day you may very well find yourself running alone. Doom, 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 doom. The sun shined brighter when she was here. Because his name is Sunny, get it? We need some handy walls. Basil. A long time has passed since you have ventured this far. Deeper layers of this world open up as the dreamers grows more desperate. Even imagination is limited. You have questions that I can answer. Answers that you have forgotten. I will lay them out for you. If you're curious, you will choose. The big yellow cat! White space, my lost friend. You would like to know about your lost friend? The friend you have lost is not in this world. The day he was removed, he was reborn elsewhere. He is special to you. A string of fate ties you two together. You cannot leave that place alone. To retrieve him, you will have to move yourself as well. 
but in a way that is natural for this world, for headspace. The journey is nearing its end. You already know what you have to do, Dreamer. Is there anything else you'd like to know more about? You'd like to know more about that big yellow cat. Before this world was created, there existed three great creatures. The oldest, the wisest, and the favorite. The oldest is alive, and not the same as he once was. Age has removed his conscience, and he has evolved into a parasite within himself. He lives there, just beyond this cavern. The wisest, against our reason, committed an act that opposed the dreamer's will. It is an act that is not even known to me. As a result, she was stripped of her wisdom and banished to isolation. A special prison somewhere deep, deep down. The last and favorite, the big yellow cat, was chosen to watch over the dreamer's most precious room. He remains the dreamer's favorite even to this day. Watching diligently, waiting for something to happen. Ah. I have a suspicion what the the one that was banished deep down. I, mean, I have a suspicion where they're located. White space. You would like to know about white space. Being white space is to be nothing. White space is emptiness, a home without warmth, a place to survive and not to live. Even still, your conscience cannot be erased. It will always find a way in. Even in white space, it will take the form. If one wills that something will be formed to subdue it. A hanging black light bulb. The repression of an idea. Yes. Perhaps it is time to admit that you are a human dreamer. Is there anything else you'd like to know more about? You have listened well. I have granted you knowledge, but know that I can also grant you power here. There is a challenge that will aid you greatly in this world. It is simple without thought, and if you succeed, I will be gone as well. I offer you this sacrifice. Will you take this opportunity? Yes? I understand. Stand very still, dreamer. Spooky. Is this the apple? You know, that one. Oh god. A red juicy apple hangs from this tree. Eat the apple. We just ate ourselves. That's okay. The more we gain 50 heart. The more we gain 50 juice. The more we gain 10 attack. 10 defense, 10 speed. I have no idea that has like serious repercussions, but we're just gonna ignore it. Everything's fine. Can I hear a voice? Odd. My opinion still stands. Talk. An unhallowed burden has been placed upon you. You have the power to change the future. What we do, Dreamer. What we do. How far will you go to save a friend?
Well, hello there, friends. The name is Humphrey. That was an intentional pun. What brings you there to my humble little cave? Well, hello, Humphrey. We're just looking for someone. Sorry for bothering you. Oh, no, not at all, children. I do love visitors. In fact, you're the second group to visit me today. The first was just a girl. A very loud girl with a big red bow. Aubrey? Does that sound like someone we know? No, sweetheart. Huh? Is sweetheart here? Where is she? Hmm. Where is she? Where is she? It's on the tip of my tongue. She's on my tongue. Go, go. That's a joke it is. She is inside me, you see. She's inside you? Well, yes. She's visiting my guests, for I'm also home to a family of sea witches. We spend no time to give her chatting and chuckling. It's so fun to hear about their daily antics. Sometimes they're even so kind as to bring me my meals. It's much easier for them, you see, for they are closer to my belly than I. In fact, I'm sure they'd love even more visitors. Here, let me lower the bridge for you. <laughs> my apologies. The first case seems to be causing some indigestion. Uh... I know this is a Jabu Jabu reference, but like... You could, are you just trying to eat me? Humphrey. Is that thing in the center of the real Humphrey? Whoa, Humphrey's belly is huge! It sure looks easy to get lost in here. I bet if I yell, I'd make an echo. Echo! Ho -ho. Ah! Where'd you come from? Welcome to my lair. Are you surprised to see me? I'm always here. I'm inside me and all around you. I'm everywhere. Or I'm just here. Well, that's so cool, Humphrey. I wish I could do that. It's kind of gross if you ask me. Wow, so rude. Huh. There are many ways to go. Where should we even start? Left. Right. Up. Around. Does it matter? It's all forward, isn't it? Just pick one, it's easy. How about I go this way instead? Weird. Equally weird. Oh, hello, Marina. You're here to steal my things again. Well, not this time. I prepared something extra special for you today. Foo, foo, foo. As you know, I'm a very busy person. Alas, you are my sister. I will grant you access to my room if you're able to solve my little gift. Hope to see you soon, darling. If you're still alive, that is. What's going on here? Gee, you popped out just a little fix up this tube. Mari, what's going on here? Now, Amori, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking to yourself, Wow, so this is a weird place to have a picnic. Well, let me tell you. It may be recommended only some picnics in normal places like in forests or campsites. But where, where's the fun in that? What if I want to study the anatomy of a whale while I eat? Then what? Spend your mind, Amori. And you set an example for my sometimes boring little brother. You guys, we can't relax right now. We have a puzzle to solve. Aren't you guys afraid the bomb is going to explode? Nah, it's not that type of game. Just relax, Aubrey. We got this. This room's full of the smartest people I know. Not me. That doesn't make me feel better at all. The lady on the screen says she set up for her sister, right? She wouldn't really let it explode on her sister. Uh, I don't know, Cal. Aubrey's right. 
We're in unfamiliar territory. It's probably better to play it safe. What do you think we should do, Mari? Huh? Oh, I think we should do what your heart tells you. Thanks, Mari. I can always count on you. You're welcome. Type puzzle theme memorization difficulty hard. Difficulty medium. Pattern difficulty easy. I just want to get out of here. I don't care about like solving the honors puzzle. This turns out to be the hardest puzzle. <laughs> I don't get what something hungry, do you read me? Oh man, they divide by zero. No. Understand what's going on. This is weird. Why? Greetings, visitors. You'd like to see something cool? So be sure you can perform remote teleportation. I can assume these are the patterns, but there's more than one. What an error! Someone must have messed with the program. Ah, uh, probably Molly again. So always pull stunts like this. So middle left is the first one. You ready, gang? Let's do it. Middle left, middle bottom. What are you looking at me like that for? Can you see I'm busy? Actually, I just got an idea. On second spot, when do you get to try running for these melon plates for me? Just want to test something. Aubrey. Huh? Me? Okay, but I don't have a good feeling about this. Yes, but that's why it's more funny that way. Wow! Ow. Ouch. Middle right. Middle left, middle bottom, middle right. Ah, I knew one of these spikes was broken. If I cup of coffee right now, I'd sip it. Fix a volunteer to risk your life. Well, I guess now I gotta go fix it. You're fine, Aubrey. <laughs> You're fine. Middle left, middle bottom, middle right. And what about this one? I want you to put a chair in your way. Humphrey hologram machine. So look at this real thing. I could be more proud. Well, I told me to stand, but I don't know why. Okay, it's middle top. All middles. Ah. Left, bottom, right, top. Left, bottom, right, top. You did it. Hmm. 
I can do the rest. Oh my god. Puzzle. This looks like one of those like cliche like cut the red wire, blue wire. Hey, worms, what's going on? It's a worm bot. Two worms. Three worms on the right. Oh, I see. One worm. Did I solve it? Was that it? A funny room without a waterfall. This bright white light is perfect for my summer tan. Okay. Based on the color of the waterfalls. Not as complicated as I thought that one would be. I feel like the first one was more complicated because it was like longer stretched out. Fee multiple choice, difficulty medium. Oh boy! weird. Okay, so I'm not even sure what's going on here. Hold up. Nice, a, a, a mailbox one. Carol, that's your weapon, right? A mailbox? I would hope not. You got mail. Wait a minute. It's your weapon. Hey, it's these guys again. Work your magic, hero. <laughs> Greetings, sir, conveyor bot. My companions and I require your assistance in changing the directions of your conveyors. Will you and your friends please aid us? No! <laughs> nice person. Get lost. Huh? That's strange. Oh, no, these are bots that want to be domed. That worked so well before. Don't be so down, hero. He's probably just got his gears all mixed up or something. Could you say that any louder? Now he's gonna get even more mad at us. Hey, Scrap Heap, you'll turn those belts around for us, won't ya? Th ah, hmm, rude person. Hehe, <laughs> just like Molly. Oh god, they are. Like, I'm not even joking. I I'm pretty sure that's the implication. I can't believe that worked. But what'd you know? Looks like I'm pretty good at this charm thing, too. Kelly, you are going down the wrong end of the charm spectrum. <laughs> what the? It's a mimic! How dare you? Are you fling rumor bands at me? Wow. Got a lot of XP for a. Uh, evil watermelon. This looks like a job for Aubrey. Do it. I can't even... I can't even make up what the letter is. Oh, crap. I was trying to debate if it was a W or not. Gut of the whale. In a large bubbly tank. So these are both in here. Waste. 
Yes. Which side is the correct side? Like, what side do we teleport in on? Okay, this side. Nice, we got homework. Where it starts sad in battle? So it's like the poetry. Um. Hey, look, this camera's taking live footage of us. Say cheese. Oh, we look so cute. Heh. <laughs> Almost makes you wish we had a camera. And uh, don't worry. We have loads of pictures of us, don't we? We have pictures of us? Where? In the picture book. But only when we least expect it. What are you talking about, Kill? Something special about everyone living their own lives. Um, you're being kind of weird. Huh? Um, no, never mind. It's probably nothing. Let's keep moving forward. We gotta figure out the solution to these puzzles. That bomb could blow any second. So that's referring to the, uh... It's like a weird thing going on with the memories in here. Oh my... Which one's a mimic and which one's not? Wait, no. None of them are mimics. This is just good. Lots of spaghetti! Where am I? Garbage. So where's the, the puzzle solution for the bomb gonna come in here? pad. I'm assuming that takes you back in case you goofed up. You need to, like, reactivate that one. I'm assuming. I don't know. How you doing, guys? How you doing? This whole Humphrey thing's kind of weird. Ho, 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 Oh no! I just realized what it probably was. Ben. Give me a check before writing the exam, or else I would have almost written it ever be. It's been pretty bad, huh? This must be for one of Molly's crazy puzzles again. This girl loves to play games too much. If she would just focus, she could probably do so much good for the world. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to switch places with one on the right. I say you're right, I mean you, as in the person standing in front of me, not some hypothetical observer watches from behind a screen. Molly told us the red letters in our back to stand this order. At least I think it was this order. Boom. Yay. Blows up anyway. You won the prize of being freed from mortal coil. How long is this going to take? I don't have all day. My work takes patience. Stop talking, darling. I need to concentrate. How about now? Almost done, darling. And finished. At last. My greatest invention is complete. Okay. 
Now speak. Speak, my beautiful robot. That sounds like sweetheart. Oh, well, that doesn't sound right. Something must be off the code. It's because you made me rush my work. Instead of love, it must now be programmed. To kill. Huh. Don't blame this on me. She's your robot. Thanks to you, my hopes of finding true love have been shattered. You've disappointed me greatly. I'm storming off. My, what a handful. Well, she's not my problem now. Eliminate original. I almost forgot. That girl, she owes me payment. Must catch up again before she leaves. Interesting. Hi, I'm Humphrey. Your all access pass to Humphrey, aka Slime Girl's Lair. Strictly speaking, I guess I'm what you humans call an elevator. Unfortunately, you only take one appointment at a time. So you'll have to wait your turn. So, if you can find me a slimy key card, I might be able to pull off some strings for you. Nyuk, nyuk, nyuk. Go north. Uh. Um. This looks like a job for Aubrey. Bark. Stranger for generate after being smashed. I see. I need you to make a uh, step for me, my friend. That's strange. Broken language you cannot read. Telephone calls up the wazoo. Welcome! Marina is not currently seeing anyone right now. She's currently hanging out in a splatoon. If you're enjoying the exhibit, feel free to crawl into a cage and wait for the next available experiment. You will know when the screaming stops. Ben. Oh. <laughs> Box filled with goo. Table covered in goo. I'm Marina's first experiment. She made me out of sand and fruit when she was just a baby. Poke. Hee <laughs> hee. Ho ho. Pet. Wish she did a cartwheel. Okay. Hands off. I'm Marina's second experiment. She me out of clay and rocks when she was just a baby. Hmm. Petting is cool. I like handshakes better. You, you're... You. It's a cyber mole. That crap was at me. Hey look, it threw a Tabino me. actually helped us out. Mole? 
Uh, there's a, a lab rat. Are you gonna be called lab rat? Yes, you're gonna be called lab rat. Why wouldn't you be called lab rat? Lab rat died. Dang, a lab rat. If you couldn't take the heat, why you even challenge me? Just keeled over. I'm doing this third experiment. She made me out of a rubber glove when she was a toddler. Poke. What? Who's there? Plans for a successful experiment. Hmm. So they call them the slime girls and there's like questionable gelatin. Is this made out of them? Dang, what happened here? This place is a huge mess. Achoo! All the furniture looks really dusty. It's probably been like this for a while. Looks like it used to be an office or something. Was it supposed to be a lair full of sea witches? None of this stuff looks witchy at all. I mean, we are basing this off of Sweetheart's sources. I don't think they would trust Sweetheart. Much less her sources. We gotta stop Sweetheart. She's definitely up to no good. We do? I mean, we can always mind our own business. Oh, is that what we're doing now? Protecting the world from evil? How fun. What does protecting the world from evil have to do with Sweetheart? Have you met her? She is evil and full of anime, which is why she's evil. Fair point. Well, I guess someone's gotta do it. Is Sweetheart gonna go to each one of them and like, they're gonna fail to deliver what she wants, per se? I'll smack that one over here. We don't need you anymore. There's a Humphrey bathing in his own blood. I'm reading his fourth experiment. She made me out of dirty apples when she was a child. Bet. <laughs> I'm reading his fifth experiment. She made me out of cardboard and candy when she was just a child. Ow! My candies! Got a whole dang chicken. And we were a sixth experiment. She made me on balloons and magic because she's just a teenager. I'm not even gonna bother you guys. You'll give me loot? Y'all suck. I'm gonna go smack that other one now. I knew I had to smack that one. I should have done it when I was there for the hell of it. Parsnip. Maybe I'm beating my some bean sprouts. Number lab rat. Basil? Hey look, it's a flower crown. Oh no, all the flowers are bruised up. It, it looks kind of familiar. I wonder who this belongs to. You think we should try to return it to them? This flower crown is in pretty bad condition. I don't think anyone would want something like that. Yeah, maybe you're right. Where? Okay, what'd you do that for? It's fine. You were here with said, no one wants something as bruised up as that. But, you should belong to someone. Kicking off a cliff is just mean. Huh, why? Flowers grow back anyway, don't they? Alright, calm down, you two. Kel, apologize to Aubrey. Fine. Sorry. Aubrey. Apology not accepted. Huh. Can 
Trying to determine if we have to like start knocking these or not. Hmm. No, there's something going down here. Weird. There's the other key we need. Hey look, big yellow cat. Oh, oh, oh god! We died. Six hundred sixty-seven. Did not poke the. Whoopsie daisy. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. No 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 no. Quick heal. Hero. Oh god. I made a terrible mistake. But the game let me continue on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get the key! Oh god! Get that key! Man, this is T for tough. Ah, run for more! Run! You bastard! Okay, we're good. Mine. Not that one. I like the spot. Which one are you? It's you. Go, 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 go. Blender. No, but here, 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 here. Cat away from me. Get this evil cat away from me. No! No! Damn you, evil cat! Oh, thank god. We know we're swimming chase, run. Meow, meow. Hee <laughs> hee hee. Comical anvil? No, it's a hot dog. Makes sense. Hot dog! Whoa, that's useful, actually. Ugh, this place is disgusting. What exactly is it you do here? That's not in your business, lady. Just sit back and relax. Ugh. I feel nauseous. It's alive! Uh, uh, whoops. Well, that'll do, I guess. Alright, it's done. Here you go, lady. One perfect suitor coming right up. Say hello to your new soulmate. Kill me! This is some kind of joke. What do you take me for? I'm ten times, no, a hundred times more beautiful than this thing. You've disappointed me greatly. I'm storming off. This like sweetheart's controlling the majority of the game, hasn't she? Hey, what the heck? You can't just storm off, lady. Where's my money? They all gotta come together to get the money? <laughs> I see we're in the potions realm. Potions. More potions. 
Lots of potions. Mini potions. Strong potions. Potions of all kind. And bubbles. Bubbles and potions. And fish tacos. Hey, check us out, humans. You know us Humphreys are strong enough to withstand a waterfall's current? What's this? Yikes. Except for that guy, I guess. Oh well, that's just natural selection working. Hey, you know what? I just had an idea. I bet if we gather enough Humphreys, then maybe we could use them to form a bridge to the other side. Hell, I was supposed to say that. Mari, this gelatin is delicious. What's it made out of? I'm not sure, Kel. I've just been scooping off the walls and floor. Do you like it? You... What? <laughs> just kidding. Where are you? I made it by mixing fruit. And, um... Gelatin. Okay, yeah. But... What's gelatin made out of? Well, Kel, gelatin, gelatin is made out of gelatin. I see. Well, whatever. Food is food, I guess. Hmm. Now, Amori, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking to yourself, Wow, so this is a weird place to set up a picnic. Well, let me tell you. Oh yeah, we saw this dialogue, it's just rehashing it. No. Hey. I need you to give me all of your Humphreys. Kill. Bang. Hey Humphrey, do you want to join our friend Humphrey at the waterfall? Of course I will, I thought you'd never ask. We just put Humphrey in our pocket, or do we, they probably just walked over there, like off screen. Cheeseburger. How you doing, buddy? Dang it, it's never a fake one. What's going on here? Well, look at all these cool plants here. Hmm. Huh. Basil. Basil? That's the name of this plant here. No, basil. I wonder if that's confirmed that his, his name is basil, not the way you're supposed to say it. Oh, it's so cute. It kind of reminds me of something. But, I can't remember what. Oh god, there's slime buns. Why are there slime buns?
There goes one. Die, slime bun. That's right. Die. I kind of has cheeseburger. Dynamite. Yeah, that's full jam pack. It's should be the last one I need. Bam. Get on out of here. We're good. Hold up, where was the last key I need? The W? In the gut of a whale. Well, that's pretty vague. Maybe we're not in the gut yet, per se. We're just like in the mouth. What the? Bagels? What? It's, it's cloudy with a chance of meatballs in here. Match up. We gained something. Got some onion rings. Game. Not that. Not blurry. Not whatever that is. Definitely not that. This next prize kind of sucks. It's a green prize, not even blue. Well, whole pizzas are a good item, I guess. Hey, what's up, guys? What a nice looking pool. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Oh, you're fine. Yep. You know what I'm just crazy about? Air conditioning. Ain't it the greatest? Things are fun. Ah, uh, right. Ah, uh, hey, left. Oh, this is that mix. Oh no, there was a blue item over there. How you doing, guys?
We gotta go back. There's more fun to be had. I don't know how we went up the waterfall, but we did. Let's not question it. Usually it's the opposite. You see, you see, you'll quite go up the waterfall. Let's go this way. There's some dudes over here. How you doing? Oh, no, there's a... A you. Okay. I would really appreciate it if you guys could wrap this up pretty soon. No rush. I just think I'm getting... It's kind of sick. Hey, look, we got an appendix. Does nothing. Get it? Now, the other key is wrong, but I don't want to get it anyways. For completionism. You. Okay, yeah. So you do the face. I don't think you can game over this, can you? Because look, one... Two, three, four. Right? The W is correct, so only three wrong. So I, then mouth. So it, be, it just, there's just one off to make it wrong, or is there a nose? What about the hair? Does that count? Y'all need to start making a bridge. Humphrey, could you please help us make a bridge now? Here we go, and now we gotta select each Humphrey. Tedious. Uh, like, I know they have cute dialogue, but it's still kind of a little tedious. It'd be less tedious if there wasn't, like, a little mini loading transition screen. Because we've already made one bridge, so it's like we gotta do it again, you know what I mean? It's cute the first time. Second time, not as much. Hopefully that's the last bridge we have to make. Confetti. Oh, there's the slime card. I guess it's probably always the last one you go into. My, it smells absolutely horrendous in here. How much longer is this going to take? My nose is quite sensitive, you know. You'll get used to the smell. Now hush, doll, I'm working. And it is done. <sighs> Finally. Hello, my perfect suitor. Wake up. Don't touch a glass, you buffoon. You'll ruin the experiment. Well, I never. Hey, there's a heart shape in the middle. What happened? Um, this sweetheart has reached Nirvana. My word. This experience is not greater than anyone I expected. Take a look, doll. 
The results are absolutely perfect. Behold, an absolutely perfect version of yourself. Don't want to be, like, outdone by yourself. Hmm. I don't like her. What did you say? If I heard you correctly. But she's everything that you asked for and more. Oh, you simpleton. There's nothing more perfect than me. But I see you do not understand that. You're nothing more than a hack. This was a humongous waste of my time. I'm storming off. Oh, I have enough of your nonsense. Kind or not, you've really struck my last nerve. Who taught you to run your mouth like that? Now, if you excuse me, this is a waste of my precious energy. I have much more important matters to attend to. Don't you dare walk off first. I'm the one who's supposed to storm off. Hmm, Mama, what's with all this commotion? There must be some fun activities going on downstairs. Oh, a slimy key card. Yum, yum. So, did you want to go downstairs now? Face a boss. Oh, that's where all three Sam girls are gonna meet. Stop right there. You can't leave just yet, doll. We just want our payment, darling. Can you see how upset Marina is getting? Where's my money, lady? Give me my money. Uh oh, it's yeah, sweetheart and those sea witches. There's no way we're getting caught in the middle of this. Sweetheart, don't do it. Let's make a run for it. Stop where you, where you are, children. I must correct you, as you are sorely mistaken. We are not witches, but followers of science. It's a common mistake, I'm afraid. Humans tend to fear what they can understand. Besides, I think I know why people think we're witches. Hey, what are you looking at me for? I decide we have a bigger problem on our hands. That's right. Where do you think you're going? Sweetheart, darling. You are a big, big bag of clams. Don't do it, sweetheart. Hmm. As if of you three peasants are worthy of my payment. All I wanted was for you to make me a perfect match. But you've all managed to fail me in three different ways. If you're so insistent to get your worthless clams, let these children cover the charge. You did it! Where do you think you're going? Humphrey! Stop her now! yoo -hoo. I'm here to report that Sweetheart has been disposed of. Uh... It's a good thing you asked. I was afraid that I wasn't going to be able to hold myself back any longer. Also... This may or may not surprise you, but Sweetheart had a total balance of zero clams on her. Zero. Not a single one. Which is quite unfortunate, as I'm getting a bit... hungry. That wench double-crossed us! I knew there was something fishy about her. Do you eat clams? Hmm. Well, not necessarily. She did say these children would cover the charges. Oh yeah, huh. In that case, she definitely paid her due. Which part of them should we sell off first? Don't be such a brute, Marina. I'm sure she meant the kids would pay us. Not that we should sell them. Alright, darlings. Now be good and hand over your big bag of clams. Huh? So, uh, yeah? About that? Just curious, 
How much does she owe you anyway? Well, let's see here. Yes, consultation fee, initial fee, setup fee, inspection fee, service fee, custom materials, warranty fee, disposal fee, shipping, handling, gratuity, cancellation fee, damages, late payment fee. So that brings total charge to about a million clams. A million clams? We don't have that kind of money. Oh. Well, that's just too bad. Humphrey, seal the exits. Dang it, Humphrey. Tough luck, kids. You walked into the wrong whale. Someone's gotta pay for all this. I would say desperate times call for desperate measures. Don't you agree, sisters? Oh, this one is stupid to sell, isn't he, Molly? Well, I like the quiet one. You'd make a great pet. Don't you touch him! He's my pet! Let's go now, we didn't do anything wrong. Oh, feisty. I think you like this one, Arena. <laughs> yeah. Well... I guess selling just one will do. Goodbye, Kill. Hey! Let me go! Don't worry, Kill. A little bit of tentacle girls never hurt anybody. If you kids can't pay us in clams, you can pay us with your arms and legs. Okay, that might hurt you. Never mind. Get out of there, Kel! Kel! No! Let go of me! Put me down! Put me down! Hey, they listen. Ah! What the heck? He bit me! I'll sell down, Marino. <laughs> it's just a little nibble. You'll pay for this brat! Well, now it seems you've got Marina all worked up. A little prey is biting back. Guys, it looks like we're gonna have to fight our way out of this place. Oh, it's a fight you want, is it? It's been a while since my last hunt. Yes, yeah, so it seems like our prey needs to be disciplined. So we need to teach you children some proper manners. For prey, you're all way too picky. You don't want to be sold. You don't want to be pets. You shall really learn your place. Well, whatever. That's fine with us. There's always another option. Well, wait, what? If you're going to keep resisting, you leave us no other choice. I'm afraid we'll just have to... Turn you into chum instead. They make calamari out of you, Splatoon rejects. Well, you have cute designs, I'll admit that. And for whatever reason, you have a rock theme. Painful true. Mm. I'm gonna tickle you. That makes sense. <laughs> Let's just go for right now. Yeah. Hey, look, there's tickling war. There's just too many fetishes going on here. Unintentionally. No more your juice. Oh, look at Kel, quickly. I wasn't paying attention. Stare at you. We're basically just gonna do our old fashioned strategy. But you're gonna run and gun. 
And I'm actually gonna snack time. Because Amori and Aubrey are gonna be, uh... Dini a healer in a second. Actually, that was a really good choice in that snack time. Holy cow. Technically, if you want to just use items, I think items actually are a better heal. Because, it, you know, you're not consuming juice in the process and you'll be healing just about the same, if not more. Um, but it never leads to get to that. All right, Mori. Exploit. Time to go to town. I'm gonna... The Mori doesn't necessarily need juice to do all kind of damage. It's fine. We got a lot of damage in the field anyways. I'm gonna conserve... Uh... Huh. You kids and boys be stealing than we expected. You know what that means? It's gonna get serious. Oh, I'm having so much fun. Crap, they're angry. It's gonna hurt. Mildly. Painful through from Get the headbutt going. Just run and gun, it's fine. Heal everybody. Hey Medusa, you think what I'm thinking? Yes, sister. I think it's about time we switch things up. Just relax, children. This won't hurt a bit. Chainsaw. Chainsaw. Well, it's fine. We can pull this from the brink. Uh, Amori is the fastest speed. He can, uh, well, no, I'm wanting to do... I don't know if you can do the all-out... I don't think you can do all-attack if, uh... Your friend is dead or not. I don't think so. I'm not sure. Just snack time it. Thankfully, I didn't do a ton of damage to Mori. Whoa! It's fine. It's good. They're just, they're just mass debuffing us. It's fine. They're just psychedelic color. They're just doing a ton of damage to us. It's fine. It's good. It's still good. Mori did not go to one health. Bad. Uh, we could get a kill on him. Actually, there's a possibility the combo attack is gonna get a kill on him. So I don't. I'm debating if I need to. Let me at least get everyone's health out of like the critical zone, bare minimum, just in case. I don't think I need to, but just some fries. Fine. And you should get some juice items just in case this fails. Where's my just drink a tasty soda, you'll be good. Yeah, see, that's why I, I, I topped everyone's health off a little bit.
Yeah, they're not dead. But that killed them. You kids are a lot tougher than you look. Huh. It's much more trouble than it's worth. <sighs> what a predicament. We feed Humphrey now. Yay. Huh. Man, what's wrong with us? This fight should be a piece of cake. Forget hunting. I'm not cut out for this kind of nonsense anymore. I'm just going to stick to research from now on. Well, dolls. Seems we were all past our prime. If only we were 200 years younger. Humphrey's pissed. Not to alarm you all, but I'm afraid my appetite's getting much, much, much bigger. Yeah, yeah, Humphrey, we got you. Bolly, feed Humphrey some clams. I got any. Hmm? I'm sure I fed him last time. Besides, he's about my clams of software for the last job. I'm getting hungrier. Okay, fine then. How about you, Medusa? Well, I... Wasn't expecting to feed Humphrey again so soon. Memory serves me correctly, isn't it your turn to feed him, Marina? Oh wait, is it? I thought it was Molly's turn. I'm pretty sure it was Medusa's turn this time. Well, well, well. It seems you have all run into a bit of a pickle. If you can't feed me, I guess I'll just have to help myself. No, my furniture! What are we gonna do? If he's gonna adjust everything? Hmm. Perhaps we should plan an escape. Um, guys, we're trapped. We've already expended so much energy. Perhaps it's finally time for us to swim the fishes. Oh my god. Yoo-hoo. Oh, that's horrifying. Man, what a waste. Hmm. Seafood. Delicious. Humphrey's out of control. How are we gonna get out of here? Keep calm, everyone. Let's look for an exit. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Guys? Guys? Hmm. The one prophet thing did say Humphrey was a parasite. My friends, may I say you all look delicious right now. Humphrey, stop this. Have you eaten enough? We promise we'll feed you later. But you can feed me now. Just let me eat you. Time to feast. Time to feast. Time for you to be deceased. Please don't eat us, Humphrey. We don't want to be eaten. It was too little late for that, isn't it? You should have thought of that before you walked into my mouth. Yuck, yuck, yuck. It's no good, guys. I don't know if there's a way out of here. Don't say that, hero. You can't let it end like this. No, 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 no. Oh, there's no need to struggle, children. Then again, it's always more satisfying when you prepare your own food. Now you all just sit still. The preparations have already been made. Dinner is being served, and you're on the menu. Go grab a toast. At least you fully healed me. Time to feast, time to feast, time for you to be deceased. Thank 
tickle them. Sadden them. We have to kill. Stare. Begin the headbutt combo. My attack. my attack is kind of scary. It's there again. Lowering of the speed helps a lot. Let's everyone go first. Pretty much got the combo setting up now. Should be good. You know, you attack or choose, but I wonder if it even matters. Like, maybe they have infinite choose. Try to double dip on a Mori? Can I just use it on myself? Is it a profit? It is. The final fight has just begun. But can you win if we work as one? Uh... Weird. Humphrey Grande. Do I need to like, debuff you all over again? And this actually works to us, our advantage, because we have, like, the, the combo attack ready to go, almost. I get some juice. I don't want to use Hero's juice. You never know we might need it. Just a Starfruit Soda would do it. Snack time it up. Yeah, we're all good. Crit to the, uh, the bread twins. Nothing has really been as challenging. Wait, hold up. We can just do that now. I 
Energy release. Thousand damage. It's a warning. I think it's smelly. It's the time for you to all get in my belly. It's not even your final form. Uh. Oh no! Aubrey! She's toast! Okay. Look at that sad face. Doesn't matter how quick or how slow, the more you struggle, the deeper we'll go. It's getting weird. Where is something I can use to make her mad? It's not what you want. I didn't realize that what it says. Okay. Do that. Get the headbutts ready. Um, juice yourself, actually. And then we'll snack time it out. Almost have another show like uh the combo attack ready. Almost said showdown. Is it showdown? I'm not sure. Just relax, there's nothing to fear. Hey Mori, is it getting stuffy in here? Ouch. Because of that, our combo meter like goes up really fast. Juice you. And... Do a group heal. Fries will... Keep us kind of topped up. Wasn't it quite that thousand? If it chomps, it, someone's gonna die. No, thankfully we're for Kel. Cooking meat is very fun. Should you be rare, medium, rare, medium, or well done? Dark. Boy, you have a pretty big health bar, actually. I might- I'm tempted to pizza it out to get my juice kind of back where it should be. But now we're cool. Where is a party juicer store? The melon smoothie will do it. Okay. Good. I'm 
whenever he's in death range. Hero needs to get that heal off. Okay, we're, we're in a much safer zone right now. It's pointless to squirm, give up my friend. I'm afraid this cycle will never end. I'll be honest, if I were to give you a VA, it'd be the, the walrus from Alice in Wonderland. You know how the walrus sings the song to the clams? That, that's how I imagine you sounding right now. Just tack normally for a moment. Juice uh, a Mori up a little bit. I'm gonna snack time. And release energy. We're gonna be putting a lot of these out there. No need to squirm. Ignorance is bliss. How many times must we do this? Hey, where did... Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. How you doing, buddy? Just start going to town on it. Uh, hero, you need to keep everyone just above alive. You do over a thousand damage per turn. It doesn't matter how quick or how slow, the more you struggle, the deeper will go. Uh, I'm not gonna do a combo attack next time, I'm just gonna like do some normal attacks here. Cook for hero. Oof. Feel free to struggle, because no matter what, you'll never be able to escape my gut. I'm assuming since the fight is over, we just did. It's no use. I would get out of here if Humphrey keeps swallowing us. Amori, I'm scared. When do we get ourselves into this mess? I don't know. My dream world's weird. Don't worry, Aubrey, we'll get through this. We've gotten out plenty of sticky situations before. This is the stickiest. Yeah, we can't give up now. we just gotta be a way out of here. Was that- was that the boss fight, though? Quick, Amori. Slice it. Going somewhere. Nyuck, nyuck. Oh, this is weird. <laughs> You'll never defeat me, loser.
Hey, that was... What? Hey, 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 was that it? How many times did you swallow me? W for whale. Blech. Ugh. Well, that didn't go down smoothly at all. Hmm. Suddenly, I feel so sleepy. I think I'll take a short nap. There's a portal there. <sighs> that was a close one. Yeah. They were just made a hungry stomach. That was really scary. But you know what? At least we got through it together. Humphrey's one weakness was Kel just kicking a ball at his dang, like, uh, throat there. So what do you guys want to do now? Hmm, I'm not sure. Are we looking for something? Wait, didn't Hero mention this before too? Yeah, we're just following Sweetheart, but... That situation seems to have resolved itself. No, I'm pretty sure there was something else. Aubrey, you're always worrying about nothing. Come on, you should learn to relax and just enjoy yourself sometimes. I guess that's true. I'm a little tired of worrying so much. So there is two things to interact with here. I don't want to touch either of you yet. I want to hit like a save point. Oh, let's try getting the W key. This will be the last key. Zero keys left. It's kind of kind of scary, guys. Guys? Uh, Basil's house is a little weird. Yeah, you're getting a good contractor for that one. That's not up to code. Black Abyss opening in your middle of your room? Yep. Not up to code. I take it you want me to go to Basil's house. There's a hole here. Yes, go into the final hole. It seems kind of familiar. Nothing really happened. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Stay away. You're not my son. Why? Why won't you fall? Amori? Should I say Sunny? Are you okay?
You have come again to seek the truth. Each time your adventures may dis be may be disparate. But as your journey nears its end, it will always lead you back here. The truth. The truth is always the same. The path to the truth was once here, but it has been removed. It was moved to a lighthouse in a pier, then to a library banished deep underground, and after that to an old barn on a distant planet. And, this time, it will be in the heart of a vast forest. No matter how many times the path is concealed, the flower boy will always find it, and your dear sister Mari she will always guide you to it. Even as hollow shells, they will continue to evolve. And each time, they will grow wings and fly too close to the sun. It is our nature. They are the only ones who know. And one has carried it with her to her grave. Death may be no danger here, but the memories of them do not fade so easily. Many times your friends have met with an unfortunate fate. Although they revive time and again, the most haunting stay in this world. Even if only their bones remain. The long lost ones sink here, to the bottom of the deep well, and become nothing. You have forsaken them, yet they still yearn for your care. Their souls know nothing but how to scream for help. Do you take pity on them? Your dear sister Mari with a bad knee. You could not bear for her to die again, so she was given the safety of a picnic blanket. It is her nature to leave and to protect. And when she does, she will leave you again and be born anew. With the undying soul that you have cursed her with. The souls assigned to your friends. They are fragile and must be protected. And so they must remain asleep. Yet... The path to the truth is closer to your most precious room than ever before. Will you be able to bury it this time? Perhaps it is too late for you. You know the keys to the other realm. They are different each time, but they will unlock the same door. The end of this journey will lead to suffering, but if you do not face this, you cannot continue. This form, though it has not shown its true self, is evil. You will not see that unless you fight it. When your intentions become hazy, they will transpire into this world like a thick fog. You will know when it happens. It has already happened before. At that time, Return to where the truth was reborn, to the heart of the forest. And like each time before it, attempt to rewrite your fate. You will be doomed to repeat this cycle over and over, or will you break it? Explore this world while you can, dreamer, until there is nothing left. We're... Okay, so we have a shortcut to the Humphreys world in the middle of our room now. Incomplete empty house. Complete. I heard a rumor about an old empty house south of the playground. I wonder if it really is empty. <laughs> no, the plants! These are sunflowers. I call that because they always face towards the sun. That's how I want to be like. Someone who always sees the bright side of things. You can't water them anymore. These things were right when I checked them last time. Maybe it's symbolic now. These flowers are called Lily of the Valley. 
It's said that they're able to ward off evil spirits and help people see a brighter future. I guess that's why they remind me of Mari. I can always count on her to help me stay positive. Roses come in many different colors and have their own unique meanings. Pink roses symbolize admiration. Orange roses symbolize passion. Yellow roses symbolize friendship. And the list goes on. Hero doesn't remind me of any rose in particular. I think Hero is like all roses because he's versatile and universally loved. These are a type of flower called the gladiolus, also known as the sword flower. As you might guess, it represents strength of character. Someone who is honest with a strong moral values. Someone who stands by their convictions. The gladiolus reminds me of Aubrey because she's always true to herself. Cacti are very sturdy and resilient plants by nature. They don't need much care and can survive even in seemingly impossible conditions. I guess what I'm saying is that even you could take care of a cactus, Kel. And these. These are white tulips. Tulips aren't very flashy plants. They're not too big or small, not too elaborate or flamboyant. If I could put it in another way, I guess I would say that. They're comfortable. Simple, modest, and perfect. Just like Sunny. I feel like this run got a little longer than before. A little more barren, too. Like that evil forest and little Nemo. There's also blood footprints in the ground. And, um, dark hands coming out of blood pool. Yeah, I don't think that was here before. Amori, I'm scared. Let's, let's go back. No. I must face myself. It's a long way down. Do you want to jump? Yes. Okay, this is not good. These spiderwebs have no work on me anymore. Even if they're weird shadow spiderwebs. I'm also brave against heights. You stairs have no- oh wait. Sister. Okay, no, never mind. Yep, nope, yeah, 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 no, we're not related. A black door casts a heavy shadow. What would you like to do? Open the door. Welcome to the Black Lodge. In space. Now this is me, with a box of tissues.
Mari's picnic basket. Sure, I'd like to save. What's behind door number one? Crap. These rooms are full of broken things. But at least in here I can see who you really are. The world that you create about this one, above this one, rather. Did you make it to pr protect this place or to hide it away? I have a way. It's become more powerful than you. Well, Humphrey. So much pain. So much pain. Yeah. No wonder we we're afraid of spiders. Cool. I see where you guys got your, uh, Yumaniki. Got that in. Explore a little bit more. Let's take a good look around. Oh, look, it's Meat World. Mmm. Okay, let's go back and get that key. Hands off, buddy. This one's not as bad. Hi, I'm a little cautious cat. Ask me anything. The cereal soup. Tomato made of cloth. Small wooden table. Thanks, cat. Meaning of life is a small wooden table. Oh my god. Hi, Amori. How you doing? Eee. Follow the cloud! I'll lead you to the right place! Because I'm a cloud! Ha ha! Blue Cloud, are you leading me to the right place? I, I, I feel like you're just... Blue Cloud, you are a terrible tour guide. Where's your commentary? What am I looking at here? Looking at pain, that's what I'm looking at. You happy I'm looking at pain, Blue Cloud? You happy I'm looking at pain? Uh. Oof. Blue Cloud, this, this tour is kind of depressing. Follow the cloud! That cat house. I feel like I'm being bamboozled. You ain't got me to crap. This looks kind of familiar, Blue Cloud. I think we've been here before. Deja vu. You know what? Forget you, Blue Cloud. It, the key's right here, Blue Cloud. Blue Cloud, you've been bamboozling me from the start. Lost in this confusion lies the root of everything. The truth that you've locked away. You must find it no matter what. You have to. For the both of us. Oh, 
All right, I need a hand to get out of here. Creepy. Does someone give me a hand? Oh, the thank you. Straightforward. Kind of ish. Are you lost? Not to worry. The red hands know the way back. That's a dang red hand. Hmm. Really keyed in. But I want to explore a little more. Spooky, scary. Ooh. Someone's done this before. Was it you? Was it me? Was it the flower boy? I guess I'll get the key now. There's a computer there and some other stuff. I don't think those were there before, were they? Well, let's go for more doors. This place looks relatively normal. Ish. The ocean stream dies to live covered in cheese. These are just the developers. Minced. I can kind of tell like, a lot of characters in the game, some were based off of uh, their like developer inserts. <laughs> I leave. What? 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 I don't know what that is. When you hit the truth, you seal the part of me away with it. He's been waiting for someone to save him all this time. On that day, when you became nothing, I was split in half. Which one do you think was more painful? Life truly has many doors. It's never been more true. Liar. That's what you get. Call me a liar, I'll step on you.
liar, liar, liar. Liar, liar, liar. I think there's teeth in the background. Hey. Sunny, I love you. <laughs> Makes sense. Sunny, I love you. Can someone actually give me a hand? Okay, how many doors we got left? About four? No, there's a couple over here. Oh my god. There's doors everywhere. Hey man, what's up? You has been very bad. You got a key. Mew stares at you. She does not know what's happening. She tells her head out of curiosity. Are you forcing me to? I don't know. Her eyes widen. She wants to go now. Mew stares at you. She struggles to break free. She starts to her eyes are full of desperation. She starts to scream, but there's no sound. She doesn't know what's happening. Ah! Cut open Mew. Did you, do I have to do that? How do I leave? Basil? Basil! Where are you? Oh. Well, I deserve this. Ah, uh, flower crown. A flower crown. Hey, watermelon. Amori, you came back for me. Is that a flower crown? I'm so glad you found it. Let's get out of here. I'll follow your lead. I get that. Growing watermelons here has been fun, but I really miss my flowers back at home. How are they doing? You take care of them while it's gone? Hee <laughs> hee. I was, until you, like, scriptedly made me kill them all. Watermelons sure are delicious. I used to cut them up and eat them all the time at the beach. I can still see Kel with those watermelon seeds all over his face. Ha! Ha! Summer vacation with friends was the best, wasn't it? Uh, there's hands and flower crowns in the water. Basil? Basil, why is everything grim dark? Basil, why are we in watermelon space? Uh, uh, never mind. It's fine. You got a key. Just get me out of here. Huh. 
Talk about watermelons. Now we're at the beach. Our friends who have suffered because of us. Can we still call them friends? No matter how much I want it, things can't go back to the way they were before. But why does Parmi still cling on? Is there still hope left for us, Sunny? I guess I can stop this whole farce. We'll go for all the doors. Why not? Some of the more interesting parts of the game so far. Oh, thank goodness you're here, Amori. I thought I was going to be stuck here forever. It's like I thought you got to slice you in half, too, knowing how these things have been going. Phew, I feel so much better. I can't believe you came here to save me. I miss you so much. Now that you're here, I can finally go home. Lead the way, Amori. Uh, we're gonna go right. I think you got spiders in your hair. You know, I think spiders are really misunderstood. They might look kind of scary, but they never attack humans unless they feel threatened. Not to mention they're also one of the biggest helpers when I'm gardening. So to eat a lot of the pests, I can hurt my plants. It's all about the balance of nature. I remember a while back, you told me that a big spider fell on your shoulder just as you were about to dive into a lake at our secret hangout spot. I know that spider must have looked so scary to you, but I promise you probably looked a lot scarier to the spider. No offense, of course. Ha ha! There's so many spiders here all of a sudden. I can feel them crawling all over me. Maybe they're just saying hello? No, they're gonna eat you. Hi, spiders. It's me, your friend Basil. So you get for being friends with spiders. So you've been smart like me. Ugh, they're biting me! Oh, I'm probably just scaring them. There, there, spiders. It's okay. I'm not here to hurt you. You dug your own grave. Yo, we're lost. There's so many of them, I can't get them off. Uh, Amori. Amori. Please. Help. Nope. A dead baby spap spider. Hey, I can finally sprint now that you're gone. I'm dead. Sweet. Free key. Where am I? Now, that's straightforward. I miss you, Sonny. You were always someone I could depend on to listen. My problems, my hopes, my dreams. You knew them all. So if you're still there, please let my words reach you one more time. Ah, oh, single flower. Single daisy. I'm looking for a handout. This will come in handy. How many doors are there? Oh, I know the answer. It's many. Uh... Nope. 
Nope. We're good. Hmm. It's kind of like Waterworld. You took a nice nap. I need that. Going for a lot of stuff right now. Hey. Oh, Mori, is it really you? Are you gonna die as spiders again? How'd you find me? Oh, are Kill and Aubrey and Hero here too? I miss you all so much, they don't exist. I'm glad the treehouse is still standing. Everyone worked really hard to make it together. Let's go home, Amori. Uh... Toast. Cat. TV. Toy. Toy. Game. Toy. Toy. Book. Toy. Oh look, there's our elevator. Let's go home. An elevator? I wonder where it leads to. Maybe it can take us back home. Welcome to the Tower of Terror. Deep well. Actually, while we're here, can I share something with you, Amori? What's up? Never mind. Ignoring. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Hold on, Amori. I, I think I'm stuck. Can you help me out? Uh-oh. Well, that's one way to head out of an elevator. Oh, Mori. I will see you later. Come on, guys, really? You gotta do this to me? You know I'm sensitive about our sister. Back then, I wanted to save what was left. But even after everything, you left me, Sonny. I waited so long for you to come back. Even seeing you now, it's hard to think straight. I can feel my heart hurting and I want to cover my face and hide. There are many things I want to say to you, but the words won't come out. I just... I wait so long for you to come back, Sonny. But... you never did. Empty fishbowl. Oh my god, I stepped on. No! I just instinctively go towards things that are intractable. Huh. Should be too many of these left. This kind of reminds me of the uh, 
place with like the tree. Amori! Psst. Amori! I'm right here! Ta-da! Surprised to see me? I've been hiding on this stump since I got here. Go back in there. I'm not the best at defending myself, but I think I'm pretty good at surviving at least. Hey, well, I knew you'd come save me, Amori. And I'm sure we'll be able to make it out of this place now that you're here. This place seems a little dangerous, but I trust you. If we see wolves or a bear, walk slower than me. Hey, Amori. You're acting kind of cold. Did I do something wrong? Oh, Shenandoah. I long to see you. Amori, I don't like this place at all. Why are you in front of me while I'm singing? We gotta sing river shanties, don't you know? At least we have each other. Huh. Actually, there's something that's been really bothering me. Would you care to hear me out? Last time you said that, I elevator cut your head off. I'm just warning you before you do it. If you come out of this tunnel... Okay, see what I said? I was about to say, if you come out of this tunnel without your head off, don't say I didn't warn you. Look what happened. Now we're done. Hey, free key. That was easy. He was right there. There was a lot of hands. And scary things. Go away, hands. I'm not ready for you yet. Breaking mirrors. It's symbolic. King of the night. What the hell? What the? This is not comforting to me at all. Can't take me out of here. Alright, is that all the doors? We run this way. Straight shot. No, there's some up here. This one right here. Ring, ring, ring. Ring, ring, ring. Mushy, mush. Sunny, we're moving away. For so long, you get the truth shut out. But something made it slip. And the hole that it made, it won't stop spreading until you find the root of it all. The one that has seen the truth. Will you guide me to him, Sunny? Oh, damn. Real tasteful, guys. Real tasteful. Yeah, 
assholes in here. Kill. Aubrey. Oh, okay, a nice world, finally. Well, everyone's been like grim dark or involving murder. Hey, what's up? Amori, you're here! Oh, I'm so relieved. I tried finding my way out, but I keep getting lost over and over. I'm sorry. You must be tired of saving me all the time. Yep. Maybe I should have tried harder. Anyway, everything is fine now that you're here. Let's go home. Now, at some point, if you start saying, like, I need to tell you something, I'm just gonna warn you, you're gonna lose your head. I don't mean metaphorically, I mean, you're, you're literally just gonna lose your head. The whole time I've been here, I've been looking through my photo album to keep me company. When I was feeling scared, I'd look at all our happy memories together. It really helped me keep my hopes up. I feel like there are some photos missing, but maybe I'm just imagining things. How are Aubrey Kell and Hero, anyway? I hope you all didn't worry too much about me. I can't wait to see everyone again. Hey. Hero? Is that you? Oh boy, look, it's here. That's not Hero. You didn't tell me everyone was here over here. Hey, chicken. Um... Yeah. That's hey, 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 come back here. You're gonna lose your head. Kel! Aubrey! It's so good to see you guys. How have you been? Did you miss me? <laughs> well, wait. Wait, what? What are you guys doing? Look out for the bat! A oh boy! Damn, guys. Well, I did warn warn you that, you know, don't trust them. Kill and Aubrey have been fighting a lot again. You think they get tired of it after a while, but they're both just full of energy. Hi, Amori, we were hoping you'd come by soon. Wanna play cards with us? We were just about to start another game. Man, Aubrey always gets what she wants. Squeak. Where's the key at? Oh, there it is. Cool. Is that how you view everyone? <laughs> Let's do the, the corner run. Gold, you and Nikki trick. Run at an angle. <laughs> You'll find all the secrets that way. No, I think that's everything. The sketchbook. This is like a little more different and grim. Maybe. Yep. There's no light bulb here. Well, I guess we can only do it with this door. This place has changed a great deal since you were last here. You will find your way back, or will you finally lose yourself? That's a religious figure. You feel as if it's judging you. Ah, hard frozen steak. Nice. It's still good.
That's the key. The church. I know why. This is the funeral. I know where we have to go, guys. Sonny, the truth is here. You've been running from this for so long. But this time we can face it together. Sonny, why did you end up like this? Sonny, I'm so sorry. Will you forgive me, my best friend? Nah. I just leave. I'm, I'm, I'm unapologetically like wondering if I can just leave and see if anything happens. There's a save right out front. Goodbye, everybody. Okay, we have to save you. Saving you is kind of scary. I made a poor choice. There's something out there. It's calling me. And it's calling you, too. Let's go together. Uh... Why did you open that door? This is what I get for being friends with people. Basil. Basil, come out of the psychological horror game. Take my hand. We're gonna go back to that comfy, fluffy stuff. Finger. Um, I think that is Basil. Whoops. There should be about ten of these. I'm... I'm so sorry. Will you forgive me? My best friend. Please, it hurts. Tell them to let... Tell them to let me go. Wait, what are you doing? I think it's a Mori that's bitter against Basil, and... What did they... What did he do? Tell them to stop. Please tell them to stop. Help me. Uh, well, Amori helped in a certain way. Oh, you stomped him on your way out. Okay. Gotta hand it to you, that's pretty hardcore. I think Omori and Basil both have some things that really need to be worked out equally. Especially Omori. The whole knife thing. Oh, 
It's the real world. Guys, you won't believe what happened. There was a shark that dealt business, and there was, like, gators, and there was a, a, a giant whale that, like, tried to eat me from the inside, and then there was, like, cute slime girls that looked like they came out of Splatoon, and then, like, I went into, like, some other dimension where, like, everything was just grim dark, and, like, I don't know. Wake up, Kel. Kel, wake up! Huh, <sighs> useless. Where hero go? Hero? Did you go out to the tree? No, you're playing the piano. You're playing the theme song, specifically. I thought you said you were rusty. Wait, no, that's not hero. You know, waltzes were always my favorite. That's why I chose this song for our last recital. But you always hated it, didn't you? I'd lock myself away on the piano. All that practicing. Playing the same song over and over. When you first picked up your new violin, you were so eager to play with me. But keeping up with something isn't so easy. Maybe I pushed you too hard. I'm sorry. I just wanted to be perfect. We never did get to play at that last recital. Did you want to play with me now? Whoa, you scared me there, Sonny. Sorry for bursting in like that. Hero, you ruined my emotional moment. I could have sworn I heard some music. You must miss Mari a lot. It's been hard for me, too. I still think about her every day. I just... Don't understand why she chose to leave us the way she did. But I knew her as a person who would always who would always want all of us to be happy, even if it was without her. You should really get some rest. Go upstairs. I'll come join you in a bit. You better not start crying when I leave. Been enough emotional trauma lately. Yep, that represents Kel's character, all right. One day left. Everyone's already gone. You have a new message. Hey, Sonny, it's Mommy. Tomorrow is the big day. The movers will be here first thing tomorrow morning. I gave them the key, so don't freak out if you see them. You're gonna finish organizing your things today. I'll be picking up in my car out front. Just come outside when you're ready. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye, honey. Are you wearing a apron? Good morning, Sonny. Rise and shine. I know it's a to-do list of those chores your mom gave you. So I finished them- Oh my god. Hope you don't mind. Also, I made you breakfast. Come down and get it while it's still warm. Kel's already on his second plate. I'm leaving. See you guys later. No way. Top of the morning, Sonny. You better uh, start eating before I finish it all. I'll eat most of the bacon, though. You're one of those people. I never played a bacon coming in hot. Oh boy, all for me? No. Me too. Fix it brunch, bro. <laughs> Is that Aubrey? Oh, who could that be? I'll go get the door. Have you seen much of Aubrey in this world? Phwah, it's you! 
Maybe it is. You, what is this? What the heck, hell? No, it's Kim. Or Lee. Huh? What's going on over there? Dang it, Kel. Now I have eggs all over me. Excellent. Well, I'm sorry, but... You're the last person I expect to see here. What are you doing here anyway? I was just about to get to that. It's just... It's Aubrey. She's not answering her door. Or her back door. Or the rocks we've been throwing at her window. She was really upset yesterday. I know this is your fault somehow. Tell me what you did to her. We didn't do anything. She's the one with the problem. Hold on, Kel. If Aubrey's upset, we should at least try to do something to help. This is Aubrey we're talking about. We've all known each other since we were kids. You weren't there when she put Basil in the lake. I told you. She's different now. You shouldn't bother people like, Kel, stop the misunderstanding stuff. This has gone on for 20 hours. It's true that she's changed, but doesn't change the fact that I still care about her. And even if she doesn't show it, I'm sure Aubrey still cares about me, too. That's just the kind of person she is. I don't know about that. Today's our last chance to do this before Sunny leaves. There's no way I can just let it end like this. We should at least try to talk to her. Well, me and Sunny can tag along. But you're gonna have to be the one doing the talking. She listens to you the most. Thanks, Cal. Hey, Kim. Thanks for asking us for help. You're a good friend. Huh, uh, sure, whatever. <laughs> Why don't you head out first? We'll meet you there. Okay, then. See you. Yo, Sonny. Thanks for letting us sleep over last night. And for spending your last few days with me. Your real friend. High five. Mm -hmm. You get off today. <laughs> <laughs>